Hello guys, welcome to this new Just Me video here on the channel and in this video we are going to discuss why I think the trend for Just Me has just flipped bullish. So I'm extremely bullish on Just Me right now. We are going to talk about that in this video so make sure to watch towards the very end. Also give me a like and subscribe to my channel and if you guys are interested in daily trade signals to take your trading to the next level, go check out my trade signal group by clicking the first link in the description below this video and I want to show you guys here this is my a trading group and uh, yeah we are clo closing a lot of trades in a profit on a daily basis this is from today you can see a lot of trades hit their uh, tp targets and also yesterday and uh, yeah we do this on a daily basis so if you want to be more profitable definitely go check that out guys so let's dive straight into the just me content here because i think uh, the trend is flipping at the moment and i'm extremely extremely bullish because as you can see here on the daily time frame i draw this falling wedge i was talking about it for a long time on this channel and right now just me is breaking above the descending resistance line here of the falling wedge so this is an extremely extremely bullish signal and i think that the trend just has flipped so what can we expect in the next few uh, weeks months and maybe even years ahead of us well if we take a look at the previous uh, bull run here for just me which started at around the end of june 2021 you can see here that we got a significant uh, push to the upside here but then we got a significant drop down again and since from of that moment we got another significant bump to the upside for just me and uh, yeah i think we can expect uh, quite similar price action because yeah, that is the way how uptrends are starting because there's still a lot of uncertainty in the market and that's why you are seeing these significant pullbacks before you eventually gonna explode to the upside and bear in mind guys that that previously around that in the other bull run from off um the end of june 2021 just me was trading uh, below one cent in fact we were trading at 0 0.0067 and we went all the way up towards 32 cents uh yeah in just the time span of a few months guys that is the power of crypto and that is how fast these assets can move to the upside but yeah from off the bottom here uh, of this of this previous bear market um its first wave up of just me went up approximately for 141 percent and then it saw a significant push back to the downside before heading up higher and right now what we saw from the bear market bottom here if this was the bear market bottom i think it is highly likely from of this moment just me already went up from approximately 50 percent to the upside so significant pump and i think it will continue the next few days but just keep in mind that these uptrends will go with ups and downs so you will not go up in a straight line you have to expect something like this and um yeah, but I think eventually, if you just hold your backs, if you just not, if you just not sell, I think eventually we will reach the price target, which is of course the top of the wedge here. Not in a straight line. There will be a lot of resistance areas in between, but I think, yeah, just holding your backs and not trying to trade this, I think is the best strategy what you can do. Of course, not financial advice. I think, um, yeah, the current prices are very attractive if you believe in just me for the longer term, but of course, do your own research. Um, yeah, so let's take a look at the daily time frame indicators here. So the RSI is climbing to the upside very strongly. At the moment, we are sitting at 62 on the RSI. So I still do expect this to go higher. I think we can easily go to over bought territories and maybe even towards yeah maybe even towards areas around the 85 on the rsi on the daily time frame i think that is what you want to see in an uptrend getting as much as possible into the overbought region and um, yeah that would be very healthy for the just me uptrend so if we take a closer look here you can clearly see that we are closing a lot of green daily candles in a row and uh, yeah it is a waiting game before we see that very explosive move to the upside so i'm talking about maybe a candle of approximately 40 percent in one day or maybe even more that is very possible that is uh, the thing we are waiting for and i think potentially that can happen in the next few uh, days weeks ahead of us so very important support for us to hold uh, at the moment is this descending uh, resistance line here and yeah let's hope it's gonna flip into support now um, for just me and if we lose that level then it is a possibility that we will go lower towards this horizontal support line here at 0 0.0041 at the moment 
yeah, we can assume that that is the bear market bottom. Uh, very high likelihood because we saw a lot of volume coming in. So let's uh, take also take a look at the weekly time frame. Let's take a look at how that is looking. Um, at the moment, uh, yeah, you can see two weekly green candles in a row. Let's see how this weekly candle is going to close. Um, we are also seeing a lot of increasing volume here on the weekly time frame, which is beautiful to see. Uh, what we can see on the RSI indicator here is uh, <clears throat> from off the previous cycle, actually, we are forming a higher low here on the RSI. So from off, uh, let's say, the, the end of June 2021, we are forming a significant higher low here on the RSI, on the weekly RSI. And from off that point, the price is forming this lower low. So you could consider this also as a weekly bullish RSI divergence, which can lead to a massive price increase for just me. So also here, we are seeing the buy signal on this indicator. Um, yeah, a green dot into the oversold region and that has only happened in the previous bear market low. So I think uh, yeah, either the bear market bottom is in now, uh, right now or we are just extreme, extremely close. But personally, I think the bottom is in. I think as long as we are closing candles above this descending trend line of the falling wedge, I think we are extremely, extremely bullish. So what is the imminent resistance for just me if we climb high, higher from off this point? I think we are going to find a lot of resistance at around 0 0.008 all the way towards one cent. I think this previous order block where we were trading in from off the beginning of May 2022 all the way towards the beginning of September 2022, I think this region will provide massive resistance for just me if we come up towards this level. But I definitely think that this area will get tested in the next few days maybe next few weeks ahead of us so if we break above this region here i think we can expect just me to uh, test all the fibonacci levels starting here at the 0.382 at around two cents for just me so yeah let's also take a closer look here at the four hourly time frame very quickly before i'm gonna wrap up this video so uh, yeah at the moment we are uh, seeing this structure here it's a little bit hard to identify uh, maybe if we uh, take it from an elliott wave perspective we could say that this was our wave one our wave two down our wave three up our wave four down and this what you're seeing right here could already be part of a wave five to the upside but this is all speculation it is very hard in this micro counting uh, environment on the four hourly time frame to predict this right so i think uh, yeah let's just focus on more on the higher time frames and as long as we are closing above this descending trend line i think we are looking bullish so yeah at the moment four hourly time frame a little bit overbought we can see that the rsi here is sitting at uh well, actually, the RSI is not overbought. We are sitting at 62 on the RSI, but on this indicator here, we are flashing a red dot. Yeah, which is not necessarily going to lead to a reversal. Um, but just be aware that in the shorter term, it is possible that Jasmine can retest this area once again. But that's all speculation. Um, I would personally only focus on the more higher time frames and on the higher time frames. I can see that we are trying to break out out of this falling wedge, which is extremely, extremely bullish. So, yeah, that's my uh, video update on Just Me for today. I will be back probably tomorrow. Let's hope that there will be some more movements in the weekend. And um, yeah, I thank you guys for watching. And also, I want to thank all of you guys for reaching 4,000 subscribers on this channel. Just a few months ago, I started this crypto channel. And uh, yeah, without your amazing support, this would not have been possible to grow this fast in such a yeah, small period of time. So thanks a lot for all the amazing support. Let's ride this new bull run all together to the upside and be very profitable. And uh, yeah, I will be back tomorrow. Um, thanks for watching. Make sure to like, subscribe, and I see you tomorrow. Thank you. Bye-bye.